So we're here at the St. John's Health Center compound. It's Friday, 26th April 2019. We just had the opening ceremony of the World Health Day and vaccination in the Americas. And we are speaking with the health promotion coordinator, Mrs. Penny Maloney. Mrs. Maloney, tell me a little bit about what the day is about, please. Good morning, Mr. Ronsan. So today was conceptualized as a way, firstly, to culminate the vaccination week in the America's Week of Activity. And we thought, why not let's include World Health Day as well? World Health Day was recognized on April 7th. And April 7th, that's the day when globally everyone, countries around the world would have come together and sign on to the World Health Organization. So that is recognized every year. But this year, we, we were very quiet with it. So we thought, okay, well, let's let's... Let's tap on into what's happening for Vaccination Week and make a grand shout about World Health Day as well as vaccination. So we conceptualized it. We said, okay, well, what we're going to do, we're going to offer healthcare services. We're also going to do some food samples, do a little bit of exercise, um, talk about vector control because we know that mosquitoes, that's also something that's dengue is very topical right now. So that's really how it came to be. We just met with everybody everybody said yes everybody was excited and we got going and here we are all right so we're hearing about food we're hearing about vector control in terms of the specific booths or the specific um divisions bodies who who who's involved okay well the environmental health department they are located in their building as well as they're the first booth when you come into the car park and when you come in they're the first booth on the right and inside the building you go in there they're dealing with vector control so they've got mosquito demonstrations with guppy fish and they've got live rats i'm told i haven't seen them i haven't been as yet and then right on the outside they're dealing with food safety so they're going to be showing persons demonstrations on food safety um, um, I know that they've got some um, cat containers and stuff that they would have taken from supermarkets of what you as the consumer can look for when you're shopping so you know, okay, is this something that I should eat? Then right after that, there's the health promotion booth. That's my booth. And we're dealing with sugar control. We have food samples to give away as well, healthy food samples. And we also have a little exercise pathway, very exciting set up. There's some hopping, some jumping, some squats. And at the end, if you successfully complete it, or at least make a very valiant attempt, we do have giveaways to give presents. And then when they go on into the clinic, there you can get dental screening. The, the mental health department, they've also set up inside. They're going to be doing screenings and relaxation therapy. We have the nurses, they're doing topometry. That's eye pressure testing for glaucoma. Um, they're also doing you know the standard weight and blood pressure, blood sugar checks cervical cancer screening, prostate cancer screening, breast cancer screening, and HIV testing. Is it possible for somebody to come, okay, I specifically want this screen done, so I don't want to be in any hopping, skipping, and jumping, but this is what I want, so I'm coming for that? Yes, definitely, definitely. It's up to you. But there's something for everybody. That's what's important. So once you come, you will definitely find something that you can do right here, and it's going to be a grand time. You're going to have fun. You're going to leave and tell a friend, call them up, and tell them to come. So yes, there's something for everybody. You don't have to do everything, but of course, we encourage you to participate in as many things as you can. What time does it go till, and where do we see you on online platforms if you want more information as things progress past this day? Okay, so we're here until just about 3 this afternoon, 2.45, 3 p.m. Um, so we're here from now. There's no lunch break. We're here straight through until then. If you're looking for us online, Montserrat Health, that's the health promotion page. And you can also check out the Ministry of Health and Social Services. They have a Facebook page. There's also a the government um, email page, sorry, not email, website. So that is moh.gov.ms. So that's our online presence. And of course, you know that we're located at, the headquarters is located at the E. Carney Osborne building there in Little Bay. We've got clinics where you can drop in and ask questions. And of course, there's also the hospital. So there are lots of ways that you can reach Ministry of Health staff. If you do have a question, a concern, a query, we're always there. Our presence is all around. <laughs> Thank you.